this bag kind of reminds me of the Taylor Swift style. If you're a Swifty, you probably know what I mean. So I saw a lot of memes online that she's like very much a fall style person. So she really likes fall and wearing stuff that you wear in the fall. And I feel like this just really represents that, but maybe my Swifty brain is just imagining things, which could very much be. Okay. Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have been gone for the last four months. Please <laughs> don't ask me what happened because I don't know. I just happened to have a very, um, like a lot of stuff was happening in my social life. So I was out and about most of the time or like um, I moved recently. So I had a lot of things to do in my apartment. I was traveling a lot. I just came back from London with two of my best girlfriends and yeah now it's the first weekend that's like kind of slower where I got to cook something for myself and just you know work out and do all of the little things and then I was like hey I um, also got a new bag and let's make a video out of it because I love making videos and I should do it more often and honestly when I started um, my YouTube channel um, or restarted my YouTube channel <clears throat> this year I had the goal of making a video or two videos every single week and that went perfectly well until I went uh, to Mallorca to Spain and then to London and I was totally out of the rhythm and then I just didn't continue for some reason I mean it, it was on my mind but somehow yeah I didn't get to but that's over now a lot of talking um, to get to the point I got myself a new bag because I felt like it <laughs> I don't want to ramble on I just want to show you the bag <laughs> I'm so happy it is the coach bandit in the crossbody version so there's two versions of this bag so coach has a slightly bigger one and a smaller one and this is the smaller version I opted for the smaller version because um, I don't know the big one I'm quite petite and I feel like wearing my bag crossbody which I want to do in winter it would just look a bit awkward to be honest so and I don't carry that much stuff with me so I figured you know what um, this will do so I will show you the bag before, like from the outside, before I go into like the details of what fits in there, the different compartments and everything. So my bag is in this really beautiful wine Bordeaux color, you could say. What I really love about it is that it's very minimalistic or like minimal. You know, there's not a lot going on. It's just super classic and, in my opinion, very, very elegant. Because I don't like bags where there's, like, a lot of stuff or, like, big logos. I mean, this is quite big, but it's a bit more understated, if you know what I mean. It comes with a strap. And I really love it. I don't know. I just think it's so beautiful. I know that there was this trend of having slightly bigger straps and that was like a trend but I never hopped onto the trend and I'm glad that it's I feel like it's kind of ebbing away like it's kind of over or like it's more like a sporty look that's my grandma what my grandma told me because she was going to buy a new bag and the salesperson told her that um, thin, str thin straps are in again um, are in trend again and yeah, I couldn't be happier because I love a thinner, thinner strap. Um, what I also really like about the bag is, of course, you can adjust how you know wide or yeah you want it to be, how long. But what I also love is it's not only a crossbody bag. You can just pull the strap through, and then you have like a shoulder bag. And I think that is so cute. Like, ah, I always wanted to have a bag like this, but I didn't want to buy one where I could just wear it like this because I'm too much of a comfort convenience person to do that and to spend the money on that, to justify that. So 
that's amazing. Another thing that's um, cute detail for me is like this coach logo thing, like this little monogram or whatever you call it. <clears throat> and yeah, back to back to <laughs> back to the front of the bag. So it's you know very sleek. It has the golden coach C in the front, and in the back it has another compartment. So you could put something in the back here, like for example. I don't know, your ID if you go out or your cards, I don't know, which is pretty, yeah, convenient for me personally. So you don't need to carry a big wallet or anything when you have this bag. There's also some more compartments inside, um, but I'll show you in a second. What's also really nice about this bag is that, I don't know if you can see it, but it's not standing like on this... Um, I'm out of the... <laughs> I forgot how to speak English. It doesn't stand on the on the bottom, but it has these little, you know, legs that the bag stands on. So it's quite supported and, you know, you don't risk uh, getting it, getting this part super dirty or anything, which I personally like, especially if you're in a bar or something and you just put your bag, you know, on the table. Sometimes there's like, you, you get what I mean, right? The straps are being held by these golden details and it's really pretty, I think. Yeah. Also, what I really, really love is I was looking for a red bag and I was looking at different brands. I was looking at, I think, um, Ralph Lauren, Ralph Lauren, <laughs> I don't know how to say it in English, oh Jesus Christ, um, and a couple of other ones, but you know, I, I was seeing a lot of bright red bags and for me personally, I believe that's quite hard to combine with your everyday wardrobe. Whereas something like this is a bit more easy, I feel like, um, but it's still a statement color. So I feel like in winter you wear long coats a lot of the time. You can't really see a lot of your outfit if you are outside um, on the Christmas market, for example. So you have to be quite creative with your with your bag choice to make it a bit you know interesting i feel like so that's why i wanted a another color because if you have seen my ysl bag video it's completely black and my new winter coat is also black in winter i wear a lot of black as you can tell so in the summer i'm very much like this flower person um lots of different colors very feminine and then as soon as fall starts, it's like a switch goes off and I just want to wear darker colors, lots of black, you know. But, you know, diversity, it's fine, balance. And I really love this color because I feel like it's perfect for fall and winter. Yeah, I, I think it's beautiful even if you have red nails or like red lipstick, maybe even darker shades. Um, it fits well with your eyeshadow a lot of the time. So. The color is amazing. Also, this bag kind of reminds me of the Taylor Swift style. If you're a Swifty, you probably know what I mean. So I saw a lot of memes online that she's like very much a fall style person. So she really likes fall and wearing stuff that you wear in the fall. And I feel like this just really represents that, but maybe my Swifty brain is just imagining things, which could very much be. Okay, so let's look at the inside of the bag. If you open it up, it has like this um, clasp, this, uh, what's Verschluss in English? Verschluss auf Englisch. Clasp, yeah. Okay, so I was right. <laughs> and um, what I really love is that you do not have to think a lot about when you close it. You just put this little bubble in there and then it's closed and that's done and I love it. It's so easy and it's not um, magnetic. I think it's not magnetic. It's just a normal clasp. It also says coach on here and it says genuine full grain leather on here. How beautiful is this done? Oh my god. Gold hardware. It's just, it sends me. It's it's perfect, it's perfect. And now look at the inside. 
this is how the inside looks like. I already put a couple of things in so you know, um, like you can imagine how big it is. So right now I have my headphones in there, I have my Dior lip oil and just some chewing gum. And there's still a lot of room so I could easily uh, fit my phone in here because there's also another compartment in the front where I could put it in. And the great thing is the more you put in, the more the bag also expands. So that gives you a bit more room even though the bag is quite small. You could also of course put it in here. I'm gonna take out things to show you better how it looks on the inside. So on the inside it's this really nice cognac color, brown color. And I don't know what this compartment is for. I feel like it's like for sunglasses honestly because if you open it that's exactly what could um, fit in there. Oh I have my coach thingy in there. Well, I'm, I'm quite chaotic. Yeah, this is what it looks like. So there's this compartment with this magnetic clasp here, so it closes um, immediately. I wouldn't put my cards in there. I saw someone on YouTube saying, oh, you could put your cards in there, but don't put your bank cards with magnets. The, the chance that they will stop working is quite high, so just don't do it. Don't. Maybe put them back here or like, I don't know, in the front, like use a little uh, card holder thing. And there's another compartment back here. So you have one, two, three, four, five compartments in this small of a bag. That is amazing. If you have like, for example, the, the chance that you lose your things is very little, like if you um, have movie tickets or whatever, you can just... Oh, you have that on your phone these days. But you know what I mean, right? So I think that's pretty amazing. I also love the hardware here, it also says coach. And the leather, like the leather on this whole bag is just a dream. It's so soft, but the bag still has like a very... like it's very firm. But it's still like super soft. I, I don't know how to say it. It's like the most beautiful leather ever and on the inside as well. I love it. Honestly, I think you could style this for so many different occasions. So for example, you could also take the strap off and just use it as a clutch, honestly. But and use it like with your evening outfit. So. I am planning to wear this for our company Christmas party because the dress code is black tie and I researched a bit and it says you are only allowed to wear bags that are like clutch sized. So what I love about it is that it fits like the Christmas vibe because it's dark red and it also has the perfect, you know, um, size and I can wear it like this or like with my strap pull through and just, you know, on my shoulder like this, or I can just take it like that, whatever, it's amazing. So yeah, you could definitely wear it like with a evening dress, so it, it, it's super elegant, it's super minimal, I think it will fit with a lot of things. Of course, you can also wear it above your winter coat, you know, maybe with a trench coat even, just like this, for convenience if you're going on a walk, for example, or whatever. I cannot say a lot about wear and tear, longevity of the bag, how it will behave when I have worn it a lot of times, because as I just said, it is very new. I will, of course, put it into my dust bag, into my coach dust bag, but um, when I'm not wearing it a lot, but I feel like if you have a new bag, you wanna wear it like basically all the time, and I think that's what's gonna happen with this one. I still love my YSL bag a lot, like it's, oh, I love it. But I'm also pretty happy that I have like a, an alternative now, now, and yeah, that's that. If you have any questions about the bag, about what fits in, anything else, just leave a comment down below and I will do my best to get back to you and to answer. <laughs> And yeah, maybe you don't want this bag, but I definitely think coach bags are really beautiful and just very good quality. Like as you can see here, it's very well made. So I don't think you can go wrong, honestly. I mean, that's my first coach bag, so I might get other ones. Let's see how this one will do first, right? 
But yeah, I think there's like, I saw so many beautiful couch bags on so many different sides. So I also feel like the tabby, is it called tabby? I think it's called tabby. It's also very beautiful. Also comes in lots of different uh, sizes and colors. And I just feel like it's, ah, uh, I am obsessed. And yeah, that was the video about the crossbody banded bag. I hope I could help you in your decision to buy it or not buy it. I, I, I would. But also, one, one more thing. If I would be very happy if you would follow me on Instagram as well. I will put my name in the description box so or like the link so you can just click on it and follow me. I have a private account so <laughs> I will check if you're a real person because I want to reduce spam as much as possible and I recently went through my follower list and I kicked out so many followers where I did not know where they came from. It was so weird like people from five years ago who didn't even use their Instagram account anymore so I had like a big clear out but if you want to follow me on Instagram I would be very happy and I will see you in the next video I hope you enjoyed and oh <laughs> I'm so out of it please leave a thumbs up if you did like this video it would help me a lot and also recommend this video to other people who might benefit from it yeah that's it bye